Here's how to program your TV. Step 1. First, determine the manufacturer of your TV set and look up the device code or codes used by that manufacturer by clicking on them up on the device code listing button on the right. If you can't find your device, click on the button at the right that says device not found for further instructions. If you do find your device, write down all the possible codes on a piece of paper. You can press pause now while you do this and then press play to go on to step two. Step two, if you look at the top of the UR4U MDVR2 remote, you will see four buttons labeled AUX, DVD, TV, and CBL. Press and hold the TV button and the OK SEL buttons simultaneously for at least three seconds. The TV button will light up and stay on for 30 seconds. This indicates that remote is waiting for the device code to be entered for the TV that we are connecting to this button. Step 3. Turn on the TV manually or with the original controller. Point the new remote control towards the TV and enter the device code. If you have more than one device code on your list, start with the first device code on the list. Slowly enter the three-digit device code, one digit at a time. You have 30 seconds to enter all three digits. If the code worked, the TV will turn off. Step 4. If the TV does turn off, test to see if the device code you entered will control the device. Point the remote control at the TV and press the power, volume, and mute buttons to see if they work. If the TV is off, it should turn on. You should be able to control the sound. If the TV turns off and on and the volume and mute keys work, then you have the right device code and you do not need to try any other codes. If you have the right code, press the TV button on the remote one more time to store the code into the remote and the TV button will blink twice to confirm that the code was successfully stored. Step 5. If the TV did not turn off or you could not control the volume or mute, you need to repeat the same sequence for each of the device codes on your list until you find the one that works. Remember, Press the TV button and the OK SEL buttons at the same time and hold for at least three seconds until the light under the TV button lights up. Enter the next three-digit device code on your list and see if the TV turns off and the volume and mute buttons work. Step 6. If you were able to get your TV to go off and on, and control the mute and volume with the remote, congratulations, you're finished and you can now control your TV with this remote. If nothing worked, then click the button that says device not found for specific instructions on how to program a device under the heading auto search method. You can also press the user manual button to see information on other kinds of programming you can do on your remote, including programming channel control, programming volume control, and favorite channels. If you're ready to program the next device, click Next Video or select the next video on the subject you would like to view from the list of videos on the left. If you're done programming, click Finished and you will be returned to the Self-Help homepage.